Is someone just counting in my head? You heard it too? Again, to talk all kinds of shit in your ears. Boys, how we doing? Oh, shit in your ears. That sounds gross. I don't yeah, want to shit in my ears. I don't know what kind of fucking shit you're into, Sean, but... <laughs> That's how I parted. Hey, baby. Want some shit in your ear? <laughs> That's how freaky I, I, I shit in my ears. Got some ears. shit in its ear. That's how freaky I get. I get shit in your ear. Oh, man. Never. I don't know, man. How's it going? My chest just felt a lot better after took that deep breath. Must be the edibles. Gotta be the edibles. It's actually late. Crazy, I it was early, but it's crazy times we live in. Technically, it's early Sunday. See, I'm a glass half full kind of guy. Yeah. Full day ahead of us, mm. boys. You're like a 49.51 guy. I don't know what that means. So everybody's Not doing all right, though? Right <laughs> I feel fantastic. <laughs> Christ. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, bro. <laughs> We're just kind of just rambling there for a second, boys. I, that's what people get with this great shit in there is rambling, gambling. <laughs> I'm yeah. not going to run down there and fuck right. one. You fuck know one of them cows. I'm going to walk down and fuck them all. Away from the table. <laughs> Your table. Whose bull? <laughs> it's my bull, and I'm walking away rambling. Happy oh, uh, one-year anniversary, boys. No, Officially what? not. Is it? Episode 52. Oh, well, by weeks. weeks. Yeah. By weeks, yeah. Episodes, not by like when we actually started. Yeah, this. June first. First one was like June first. I don't think it's not June first, is it? What month is it? <laughs> <laughs> we're like, we're like, it's the thirty first. So when it goes, uh, well, Monday would be the first. Right there, yeah. This is officially In the, the future. The one-year anniversary podcast. That's great. Maybe one. after year two, someone will listen to this. <laughs> hey, man. I hope. After this 2020? Jesus, maybe. Someone needs... Might not even be podcast in 2021. I hope we can at least, you know, service our people with an hour escape. Where are we going? Where are we going? Red pill. Where are we escaping to? Dude, those ash, those astronauts that shot off into space today are the luckiest fuckers. They're like, dude, we are out. <laughs> They're gonna come back down oh, to a whole shit. different See this planet. planet later. Be like, bro, text me when it's over. <laughs> text me when it's over. When they, <laughs> when they come back, it's gonna be a different fucking place, man. Oh shit! It's. Oh, I'm crazy. telling you, we joked last week about sharks with laser beams, but I think it's going to happen. I really right. do. Well, like I'm not I, going in the ocean anymore. That uh, that uh, a headline I sent you guys. Machine gun pigeons. First time it was first time it was a motorcycle monkey trying to steal a baby. Now it's monkey stealing the COVID nineteen off of oh. lab assistance. I'm telling it's you. Idiocracy meets Planet of the it's, Apes. It's coming. It's like <laughs> anything, it's Murphy's Law. Anything can go, will go wrong this year. I'm literally going to stay on this chair for like, what do I got, six more months? Six more months, I think I can make it. I'm getting out of this Bermuda Triangle of a fucked up year. Look at this guy, just drinking fucking Reds. What's going on? I'm freaking out, guys. They changed the plate. They changed the color. It's like pink. It looks Is like piss. Why does your beard taste like, like piss? Because we pissed it. It's piss and other things. 
<laughs> I've got pisses there too. Movie reference. So did you guys watch the fucking space launch or were you? I did watch it. Your turtles, your thumb, and your mom. I don't know. I I re I saw that it took him ten minutes to get to the freaking space space station, which is insane. Oh yeah, you gotta. Bro, I was just watching like the miles per hour just go 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 go. I'm like, is that ever gonna stop there? Go like ten thousand miles per hour. <laughs> what was it? What was the top speed it went? Do you know? I don't know, bro. But when I saw it, they were doing like nine hundred. I'm sorry, nine. Thousand? Is it? No, it can't be nine thousand. Jesus, just drive your truck. <laughs> it's where was the the the, 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 the Kaba? Gotta huh? watch it now. <laughs> it's pretty intense, bro. No, it, it is crazy. I mean, like, uh, it's the first step to commercializing, right? We're gonna be able to go to Mars and get the fuck off this planet. In another... Yeah. Bro. That was the um, commercial. Was it the dragon? The the spaceship was the dragon. So that is uh, the prototype for what we would make to commercialize like planes and shit, and it would fly to Mars or space stations eventually. Bro, we're gonna use this planet up, bro. Are you saying the right word? What? You want to colonize Mars? Colonize. Or are you talking something else. I, I mean, just I mean, just, it could just be a ride up there. I'm just like. I'm gonna go there and and then I'm gonna come back. I can't like what are the flat earthers panicking right now? <laughs> oh, that, Ooh, that they're not gonna fall off. Videos? That's actually a good no, question. Because they're gonna get shot. I would just shoot all the flat earthers up in space. <laughs> but just get, so they can, let me, yeah, let me, that'll be their last ride. ride. Blow we're gonna, this we're thing up. So, <laughs> do, this right now. so do flat earthers believe in other planets? Of course they do. They're flat. Are they? Well, are yeah, they? Are they round or are they flat? They're round. See this. This is what they believe that the Earth is flat and the Earth is the center of the universe. So even the sun goes around. Everything goes around us. We don't go around the sun. Uh, I've researched this. One sun blown. How do you explain it being light 24 hours a day for six months of the year up? Dude, there's people who think because the Earth spins like a thousand miles per hour, they write comments like, how are we able to stay on the ground if the Earth is spinning a thousand miles per hour? <laughs> it's fast, dude. Just think about it. I mean, do you just have really good balance? It's, no, because you're also moving at a thousand. It's like when you're in a car. when Moving at a thousand and one, bro. I'm fast. Dri driving fast. 50 miles an hour in a car, your body's going 50 miles an hour as well. Right. No, a thousand and fifty. So that's you get thrown out of that car. Then it's a different fifty-five. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> Depends on which way the world's sliding at that yeah. time. In the car. <laughs> that's no. It. It's out of the car. <laughs> no. Oh, uh, twenty twenty is bro. that. <laughs> that is what twenty twenty has become. What, what is star zone? The the <laughs> the projectile out of the windshield of a car. <laughs> the year uh, started out shitty. It is just, I'm just gonna it's say getting worse. Windshield stopped me before. I guess my heart my head's not that hard. You remember that car, the '93 uh, Geo Metro, five speed. Ugh, the pussy hitter. Was that a three cylinder as well? Uh, yeah, was that a three yeah. cylinder? It was a three-cylinder. I put 10 bucks in it. It would last like two months, dude. That car was so awesome. I remember people picked it up and moved it in the fucking high school parking lot. I used to, do you know how many chicks I taught how to drive stick shift in that car? You know how many chicks had to... They just got in and Frankie's like, please sit on the plastic. <laughs> that was because... Uh, oh, that was the Neon. I was going to say the G The Neon had the... Um, the roof it looked like someone blew their brains out in there. <laughs> I was like, yeah, I got it for a real good deal. I was talking about how wet the ladies got. <laughs> oh, yeah. You didn't want them stay in your seats. Yeah, no. You just uh, scoot over a little bit, honey, on that plastic sheet. <laughs> you, you can't, and then, like, when you're driving something like a 93 Geo Metro, you can't get, like, stains and stuff, so they got to swallow. It's just rules. 
I mean, <laughs> oh, I so that. Right. don't be getting in. Don't be getting in all the love, though, are you? I was getting. Uh, That's pure naga hide. Just getting an old, uh, you know, an old BJ while driving a stick shift. Not easy. No, you, you, you. That, that talent right there. <laughs> getting into fifth is always a rough one. <laughs> Keep it in like third, second, second and third is right there. Jack yeah, of all you, trades. You, you know, talk them into some stuff. We're on our way to go. <laughs> we're on our way to go bowling. You know, getting a little RH. And I'm like, yeah. oh, you're going to have to swallow it. <laughs> They're fine. Can't get nothing on these jeans, so no. <laughs> we're, we're going, going to Cosmo. <laughs> Cosmic, Cosmic bowling. bowling. I can't have a, a big oyster a stain on my pants. A pants can oh. light up like a goddamn Chris Bosch. <laughs> it looks like a Jackson oh, Pollock shit. painting. Oh, boy. Is that the one time you showed up with the uh, sweater wrapped around? I thought that was weird. It's <laughs> not your style. That's not yeah. your style. And I had it on backwards like Chris Cross. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh god, boilings are fun. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> That's what you got <laughs> out of that story? <laughs> uh, boilings are all, fun. That's, That's the, the greatest box. ad. We just made the greatest <laughs> ad for the fucking bully. Oh, <laughs> for the USBA or whatever the hell it is. <laughs> the United States Bully Association. Fun. That just is, wrote a, just, just wrote, wrote the best ad days. for him. <laughs> Bowling. Get into it's, it. It's the new thing. <laughs> I'm just saying, can we, uh, can we set up like a bowling alley? Do like oh underground fight club? <laughs> First rule. Oh, bowling. First rule about bowling you tournament. might get roadhead. I, I mean, like that's Rodan. Like, that's like stretching. Bowling Alley Strip Club. <laughs> this is what I'm talking about. I've been saying it for years. Bowling Alley oh. Strip Clubs. There's stripper poles between the alleys. And? And? The an oil change this center. We're starting. I, I got a whole fucking <laughs> With an oil change center. So during the day, they're open. Yeah, you drop your car off and get an oil change. Go get an oil change, get a lap dance, throw a couple, and throw a couple games. Frames, watch some dances. <laughs> <laughs> There's nachos and cheese. That's it. Just nachos I and think, cheese. I think we might have created the greatest. <laughs> the greatest. I'm just saying, that's the place I get my own. A bowling alley attached to a Jiffy Lube. <laughs> that's it. With a strip club inside of the bowling strip alley. Strip club with the nacho joint and beer. And I, mean, I mean, Jiffy Lou, we don't even have to change the name. No, no. We got an ingenious marketing no. idea for you. No, there's a machine at work, and it's called the Mega Lube. So the name of this place is Mega Lube. <laughs> we'll see if they need a partner. Mega Lube is attached well, to the bowling alley. We're looking for investors. Possibly you. I love their seats are full of glitter and Vaseline. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna oh, lie, but man. hold on. Why I don't know why it's ridiculous though. For thirty plus years, for some reason, you are always, always, always covered. Now you can't glitter. say covered. That's that's pretty extreme. Now people are gonna close their eyes and picture me like a glitter, glitter doll. Out. Yeah. All right. Picture me you glittered have, out. Like, I like always, always have a piece of glitter. There's always like two or three in, in different <laughs> spots. Like if you were to like look at you at any time during the day in the sun, you're gonna have three pieces of glitter. How dare you? Where did they come from? Maybe one random. Where does it come from? I don't know. From my show. I want to know. Are, is, are, you having, are you having? <laughs> are you having breakfast at the strip club every day? Do we need to have a talk? Ooh, what's going on? I can't eat I pancakes and not see a nipple. You saw a nipple? Something bothered I, said, I can't eat pancakes without seeing a nipple. Oh. 
You put the butter on the top or you like the fruit, the pancake? When it comes fruit to the grapes, it was so I was weird. Just syrup and butter. Fucking the f- naked chicks dancing and then you got like like meatballs <laughs> yeah. and cheese curds. Like, <laughs> what are we doing here? Why is there a buffet at a strip club? I- Did he pass me the tongs? No, I said tongs. <laughs> tongs. <laughs> Cinnamon, you left this over here again. Oh, fuck. Get it away from oh, the meatballs. Man. man, I hate this place, but they got good meatballs. <laughs> yeah, this place got the best meatballs. <laughs> oh, shit. There's spaghetti. <laughs> we tell you. I'm telling you, we're, we're going to make it. We're making millions on this idea, boys. <laughs> it's probably going to be up tomorrow. Bowling. Bowling, strip club, strip club, lube. mega lube, <laughs> family fun center. Jesus Christ. We put like a zip line. Here comes Tiffany to oil your lane. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's fucking great. That is great, dude. Your lane's oh, open, you know. Mr. Henderson. We do like the old school scoring where they gotta like, yeah, write it on the board. Yeah. No, I don't know how to keep no, score. No, be, and I've also, been on like six bowling leagues, and I have no idea how to keep score. And, so and everything's also, electronic. and but also, you would have Common Core math up there because it can't add numbers normal. Anymore. There's people that know how to do it. Where like we bowled and shit, and they're like. If you bowl like two more strikes and at least get four pins, you got three sixty four. You're like, what? Huh? Yeah, three sixty four. You can't go anything over three hundred. Yeah, you. You look like you're thinking about it though. Oh, <laughs> no. <shit. laughs> He's like, you can't go over anything minute. over three. Uh, you are correct. What's... Stone Zone. That was um, where I just was. Does anyone want to talk about this ridiculous thing that's on my face? No. Looks like just you, no. It looks like you got a fake mustache on. It's not fake. <laughs> <laughs> it's not fake. Turn to the side a little bit. Especially now he's got the headset on. Jeff yeah. fucking Fisher. <laughs> <laughs> I got the mullet. I got the mustache. I don't know if that's a mullet. It's getting there. You can't see it. There's too much Mm. going on. Getting. How dare you call that a mullet? People's actual mullets are disrespected. What do you mean, bro? I've been in quarantine. I can't get it cut anymore. Let's say. Let's see. If you're trying to grow a mullet, you're, you're not supposed to cut it. Yeah, I still had to be out in public, and my hair was as short as your hair is, Sean. It was fucking faded all no. the way down, all the way up, and I had short hair. Your hair was never that short. On the sides, it was. Yeah, it was. I could do a zero. So I went from a zero to growing yeah, my hair. Right now. Yeah, what? My hair doesn't grow that fast, I guess. In what, seven months? Yeah, but Only you had cut after that, right? I, I so you're cut. Right I, when I first said I was gonna grow haircut. a mullet, it was after a haircut. Right, I got a haircut like that day, and I was like, I'm gonna grow a mullet. And then the next time I got a haircut, I was like, let it like grow a little bit more in the back, and just kind of like shave up the sides and just keep it like clean. And then, and I then you that, started like, looking like Chris Bryant. My hair. Yeah, like the yeah right, like the Chris Bryant. And I only did that like two or three times total, like November, December, and. January, I went and got haircuts, and that was it. And then since then, I haven't had a haircut. Well, because you uh, can't get out, you haven't left your house. Right. The last time, I mean, before I had a haircut, it was like uh, the end of January. It was kind of before C2E2. Uh, was the last time I had a haircut. So, so now it's fresh. been like three months, four months, and it's finally starting to grow. And I did shave my beard off. Awesome. I'm going to keep it. 
Yeah. Maybe trim it up a little bit because yeah, I like fucking bite into a sandwich and I'm just ripping hairs out. Oh, just, no. This is your first mustache. I mean, you should be excited yeah. about it. Look at it. It's glorious. You look like a cop in a 70s porno. You look like fucking Jeff that. Fisher. It's driving me nuts. <laughs> oh, my God. Turn to the side again. Holy fuck. You look like if oh, John Stamos fuck. was going to play Edward James almost in a movie. Oh, I feel like I see this full of Oh, dear God. We're sorry, audio listeners, but... Why does it look this... like he's wearing a wig? I don't know. He looks it exactly looks... like Jeff Fisher, and it's freaking me out. <laughs> he does. God damn it. All right, listen here. We're going to go two Z banana on four. Who's banana? ZY spider. That's Now you're getting them all mixed up. That's John Gruden. You're getting John Gruden mixed up. Jeff Fisher was like, oh, I don't know any. Hand the place. ball off. The fucking. Run, run up the middle. Ugh. Dude, Frankie, you dodged a oh. bullet. Hmm. You dodged a heavy bullet lately. Why's Did that? you know that they changed the zodiac signs? I'm not really? an Aquarius anymore. You're not an Aquarius anymore. Yeah, no, nope. I'm, I'm no I'm longer a Capricorn. A, yeah, I'm no longer a Capricorn. I'm like a Sagittarius or something. What about like Frank? Fuck, Frankie's got Aquarius tattooed on his leg, <laughs> like real big. Real big, it is. It's my whole leg. You're gonna have to change it to Capricorn. We'll burn it off. What is the date? No, you you're still safe. <laughs> All February, right, I, was gonna say that I think it, it, February 16th now is like the start of the Aquarius. Oh wow! That's uh... Did they add a new one, or what's going on? I don't understand. This Does is it really bullshit. matter? I don't believe it. I, I don't know. I you used do, to believe it. Oh, I what know. if you met like one of those those gypsy girls that don't shave their legs or armpits, <laughs> and she was like all about astrology, and she's like, oh my god, I am aligned with an Aquarius. My life is complete. She's a Libra. She's supposed to be with an Aquarius. I don't even know what he's, how any of that shit works. Bam! He's a Capricorn now. Fucking up all her fucking stars and stripes. <laughs> Thought she had the man of her dreams. Yeah, but... He's a Libra. She's supposed to be an Aquarius. <laughs> but now, what, what happens what if... Goddamn Capricorn. What happens if she has, she's no longer a Libra? <laughs> right. So her fucking whole thing is oh. maybe she's now... Um, I don't know. Was it? I don't even know the crocodile one. <laughs> the crocodile one. She's well, an Amber Crabby and Fitch. Is it yeah. all the cost? Uh, oh, Maybe she's the cost now, and she's supposed to be with an Aquarius. No, I thought Aquarius she'd be a Nautica. This gypsy is just. <laughs> so, this gypsy is <laughs> fucked up. Dude, imagine so 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 if you might get, you might just get too high and just sit there and be like, what? <laughs> Well, I mean, well, you know, what if you guys you met then? Does it still count? Your feet smell and your nose run. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dude, my fucking mind. I can't take it. Oh, yeah, dude, I had a jokes. good one today. I forgot it. <clears throat> Sorry, guys, for the buildup. And no, <laughs> and no payoff. Hey guys, I had a really good one today, Bobby, about noon, but that's like uh, fucking 14 hours ago. I don't remember. I don't remember. So it's gone to the It was a dam. Damn! Damn! Yes! I love that thing. Oh, yes. Just remember, boys. Just remember. There's always room for family. Bam. You know what else there's room for? Stovetop stuffing. Yes, yeah, stovetop stuffing. <laughs> Our new sponsor. 
No, I'm kidding. <laughs> He's a sponsor. Dude, we get so stove stuff, 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 stuff in that strip club. Just <laughs> 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 have oh, some old shit. lady, some oh, old dress. Scoop it flat. Come get your stuff in, hon. <laughs> There's stuff it all over, like, you know they got that weird carpet, like, old AstroTurf at the strip club, it's not, like, carpet, it's not hardwood floor, it's, like, some weird hybrid flooring at the strip club. Yeah, because like, you can clean it off with a hose. Can you on Wednesdays or what? Because you can clean it off with a hose. Old grandma's got one of those... One of those vacuums that doesn't even need the power, like, sucks it off itself by just going back and forth. <laughs> yeah, the auto brooms. Uh, just no, the it's the clothes. roller one. I know what you're saying. Yeah, the roller bl- brooms. <laughs> it's like, um, silent but effective. Right, it's, it's like, like those lawnmowers that just spin in circles while the wheels are moving. Now, those are, what is it, what's the thing with the ice where you... Yeah, and the ice of the thing's going in the curling. That's what it is. What? Well, it's with the sh- You know what I'm saying? Yeah. When you yeah, use yeah, a little push but in, in this in this like strip curling. club bowling alley bag of so lube curling in the strip and curling club. there as well. Ooh, curling okay, center. What's, what's that other game that we play all the time back in the day? Shuffleboard. Shuffleboards, you already do it. You have to fucking say anything. Well, now you're now you're opening a strip club slash David Musters. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, what, what are we doing? Yeah. And, and then we got a I'm bunch of arcade so games. Sad. Right, arcades for adults. Oh shit! Give away a bunch of useless toys, and you gotta get tokens. Oh, oh. Can you imagine a stripper worked all night long for those dollar bills and then she blew all her money at the arcade? <laughs> so it's just <laughs> itching, itching, just give her itching to play video games. <laughs> Trying to get that one on the top shelf, honey? The yeah, big giraffe? She's so mad. Claw machine's got Monet on it. <laughs> Blows all her tips. <laughs> I had a great oh, night. Man. I had a thousand dollar night tonight. <laughs> Now I can't even pay rent. The claw machine got me again. I can't wait to go back out in public and real world, real life. I think that's a lie. <laughs> I mean, I miss you guys. Don't get me wrong. Uh, I do. Jeff and I were going to do this episode at the house, but Jeff had family stuff come up and we had a late jump. Yeah. I was doing them. He's doing them family. Barbecues, bonfire, uh, drinking. Yeah, that's a cool. Just stuff. your typical American Saturday. Did a bunch of landscaping today, and did burgers on the grill. You did? Mm. What'd you do? Trim a hedge? Ah, uh, all this <laughs> shit. All this <laughs> deck I got out today. I gotta replace the boards and the. Did you sweep it? <laughs> I, did. I raked it. I raked it. You raked the deck? No. No, you sweep the, the deck. deck. You sweep sweep my dick. And if you know what that so movie we, is. Oh, awesome. I, I just wrote it. Yeah. That, if you've <laughs> ever seen that movie, then you're definitely listening Not to the right podcast. Have. You're definitely listening to the right podcast. Right. Because that movie. This is like the I Hope They Serve Beer and Hell podcast. Pretty much. <laughs> uh, they don't have reds there, though. I'm telling you that right now. In hell? In hell? No, yeah, they have the, like, the, reds. The, what reds, what flavor don't you like, Jeff? Because that's what they got. The kiwi. I don't know. It's the kiwi. Kiwi, stra- kiwi strawberry ruined my life. I don't like the kiwi. I don't like reds, period. I like them for a good, uh, you know, couple, one or two to get Change off. pace. When you used to, um, I think you first got on that kick, we were on the boat and shit still, by the way, is on Facebook. And, uh, you shout, out to, uh, shout out to Nick. 
Yeah, Murphy man. Bosch turned me on to the old Red Zappel Ale. Yeah, yeah, but you would uh, put down four six packs on one day in the boat like it was nothing. And start drinking my beer that I didn't What's finish. wrong? It's just a cordial. It tastes just like apple juice. <laughs> Is that your third beer this morning? <laughs> They're just a cordial. Yeah, yeah it's fuck, man. It's 7.30. We just got out of here. I'm just trying to unwind. Totally science, guys. No, it's you should back to my use. If, if these were in a box with a straw, it'd be even better. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's another oh. boxed wine, but in the small boxes with a straw. What about, into about it. you just don't, don't see enough box beer? Hey. You know what? A oh, box shit. of beer. I, th- I think it's the carbonation. With a straw? I think it's the carbonation. I see it have in a box? The carbonation. A case of beer, right? Yeah. You saw one? I've seen a couple, yeah. Yeah. It, it, it And there's this case that fits exactly over the case of beer to keep it cold. It's like a liner. Uh, a liner has a zip that you just zip it open and fucking grab a beer out, and it keeps your uh, so case it's cold, and you never have to put it in the fridge. So it's a cooler? Yeah. <laughs> Like they've been around for a for hot case minute. Of to keep it cold. They've been around for a yeah. hot minute, dude. Never seen it before. I was Coolers? damn impressed. Oh, like a jacket for your case of beer. Yeah, they jacket. have the they have the coolers like that. Like, like zipper. Like a, like a jacket or a sweater. <laughs> More like a cardigan. It's like a <laughs> <laughs> killer boots, oh. man. I feel, I feel like, like a turtleneck, turtleneck though. though. Like it's tight. It's, it's like, like all the way up. I would like to see you try to wear a turtleneck. Do you want to see me wear a turtleneck? I want to know. So it goes so around. You want to see face. right now? So I haven't seen my chin in fucking seventeen years. The first time I was surprised. Really yeah, white. Your chin? Mm-hmm. Needs to see the sun. Out of a day, bro. Bro, I sat up for like uh, I was cooking on the grill and stuff. I sat up for like an hour on the deck. I removed my chain. And I had this fucking white mark in the middle of my chest. It was so bad. It lasted for like four days. <laughs> for the Lord? Chains. For the Lord? I don't have a golden one. <laughs> Easy Serpico. Easy Serpico. <sighs> Uh, Mr. T starter kit came in the mail. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, that's the Jersey Shore starter kit, but like from '86. He got he got yeah, the wrong the box. Bullet, the mustache. I got the chains. All you need is an I Rock Z. Ring. All you need is an I Rock Z, and it's over. It's I over. see one for cheap. Oh, pop. Was it a T top? It's got to be a T top. Oh, for sure. <laughs> for sure. I'm, I'm telling you, man. With a blau punked. It's, it better have a blau punk, dude, or it's, it ain't worth shit. Sure. We open a used car lot slash strip club slash bowling alley slash. That's shit. why we got the mega lube, bro. We can sell the cars right, through the right. mega lube. Go big, mega. Huge. Mega lube will get you grease. Huge. Oh my god, it's huge. Fucking huge. Oh. Thank you. We need we Thank need an you. ad for the Mega Lube. What's a cooler sleeve? <laughs> I'm telling you, I'll send you a picture of it. You're gonna be like, it just like fits around it. Yes, yeah. it's like a sleeve. It's got a zipper. Slide your fucking case of beer inside it. You zip it up. But it keeps not it every case of beer when is you want the same beer, shape. You just zip over a little zipper. What is it? Right there. So it's I like don't a, fucking know. A cold sleeping bag for your beer? <laughs> yes, it's a snuggy little. It's a snuggy for your. Little it's like rest. it's it's basically like Stay a big cold. version of those, the lunch Dude, boxes. Dude, that's the perfect name. Snuggy for your beer. It's called the chuggy. It's called the chuggy. I love oh, the chuggy. That's that something we can get behind. Here's a here's a fun fact PSA for everybody. If you go to get cigarettes 
and they don't have any hard packs, just get a soft pack. It fits perfectly in an old hard pack. What? Yeah. It's like, all we got is soft packs. I was like, just give them to me. I know a trick. Give them to me. I got an empty box in the truck. (laughs) Do you have an empty box that's not crushed? Like, if you ever run out. Yeah. Well, you don't need that shit anymore, right? Uh, um, no what is it? For me. What the, what's today? So it's six months. We're six months smoke free. Maybe. Congratulations to you. Congratulations to you, my friend. Oh, thank you, sir. Congratulations to the both you of too, you. Sean. Great job. <laughs> I worked hard. Keep it going, bro. Keep it going. Oh yeah, I'm proud. Oh yeah, yeah. It's, it's a good accomplishment. accomplishment. I, I've gone it 41 years without cigarettes. I know, okay, but thank you, Con. I was like, did they pay me twice? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> There's so much money there from not smoking. I'm like, Jesus Christ. Especially now. Uh, Prices right. are going well, through the roof what, again. Eight bucks a pack? Yeah, I mean, I'm saving about 400 a month. That's cool. Buying carton after carton after carton. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it was bad. Bad. Dude, watch. It, is, it does suck. Watch, though, like, the first. Only in a movie. <laughs> Like, Son the first bitch. video episode of the podcast, watch how much he smokes you guys fucking hammer down through that hole. <laughs> I bet, dude, but when it was oh, in yeah. the just, we it, it, it was just oh, a yeah. the constant. We got, the more we lit up. That was my little spur. I was already, I quit, like, before I started smoking again. I quit for, like, six months, so not hopping back off this wagon. Uh, Jesus. It was, yeah, though, you just, just it was a constant. So I, Go ahead, Sean. No, I was just saying it was a constant roll of cigarette smoke the whole time. Did you love it? You, you fresh, Sean. Did you love it? Oh, my God. Did you love it? I'm so proud of you guys for not smoking. <laughs> He's just happy that he doesn't smell. I don't have to smell like that, dude. It I was so bad when you're not a smoker. Oh, it's just fucking reeked gross. of fucking cigarette smoke. But when you are a smoker, it's... Uh, it, it smells good. It's it's weird. It's so it's oh it's fucking a drug. It's nicotine. It smells like shit. I, I, don't, I don't want it. I don't want nicotine in my body. Like I want to roll a blunt so What's, bad, but I won't even smoke tobacco paper. I don't even want that in my body. What's crazy yeah, about there's like little 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 bit of nicotine in it. What's crazy about not being a smoker? I always did enjoy when someone would first light up a cigarette. The first light up. The first puff is the best. Like well, not just the smell, smell from that. <laughs> yeah. I miss that <laughs> smell. The first light up smell. All the rest of it can go away. Just give me that first light yeah. up smell. It's, it's just different. different. Like I mean, I'm, I'm really, I'm, I'm more, uh, I'm more proud of Jeff than I am for myself because I'm not the biggest drinker. And when I do drink, it's, 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 it's like hand in hand. I like it really, actually, like calms my stomach and shit while I'm drinking. Like, sometimes you start getting, like, the, you know, watery mouth. They're like, oh, God, I'm going to throw up, light up a cigarette. And I was like, all right, I'm good. Let's have another shot. It's weird how that works. But, uh, Jeff's still a big, you know, he still drinks. Like, he's the drinker. Like, I'm not drinking as much. I don't it's like anymore. <laughs> or any less. Or any less than he used to. <laughs> That's exactly what he was going to say. <laughs> Jeff right now is is honestly looking <sighs> like a young Michael McDonald. All he needs is a keyboard in front of him. One day, guys. And sing, take it to the streets. We, we, we learn how to play guitar before I play the keyboard, all right? We, we got to start, start this cult, and, and there's not a lot of people <laughs> who have started cults <laughs> with, with keyboards. <laughs> okay. Ooh, what if you start a cult <laughs> with a guitar? What if you go? Oh. <laughs> there you go. Damn, what will we even call it? Stone Zone. Oh, no way. You want to go in the Stone Zone? Yes, if you started a cult with a guitar, this is definitely. Why do, this is a Stone why Zone. Do circle pizzas come in square boxes and cut into triangles. My fucking brains. I don't know. 
Whoa. Oh, oh boy. Hey, look, you guys switch sides. That was a glitch in the matrix. What is that? Al Frankie, Al Frankie, you, you look, look a lot, lot different. different. What's, What's happened? happened? Yeah, your camera zoomed, zoomed out. way out on you. Mm. Looks like you're hanging out inside a furniture store. I think, I think all of us. What just <laughs> happened? The... Dude, Dude, I, I think, think honestly, honestly we stayed up so late that, that we just witnessed, witnessed the Matrix, Matrix resetting. resetting. <laughs> <laughs> and it's and it's captured on this podcast at the forty minute mark. Wow, wow guys! So, so if you're hearing this, this it's already, already reset. reset. We, we can't go back. I don't know if this is. No, zoom, zoom back, back out. Let everyone see how many couches there are. <laughs> like I said, it looks like he's living in a fucking know. furniture <laughs> store. Fucking <laughs> sign <laughs> apples. I don't know what's happening. I, I can't, can't see anything. anything. Frankie, Frankie's squatting in a fucking stein Dude, apple. Frankie, Frankie, zoom, zoom back, back out, bro. I can't buy my screens, screens off, bro. He's like, yo, bro, bro they, they got, got free cable. cable. <laughs> Their Wi Fi is strong as hell in here. <laughs> How, How many, many couches, couches do you have? Uh, one. And is anybody looking for couches? <laughs> you need a couch. A couch. Yeah. Yeah. What? Come to Crazy Frankie's Couch yeah. Emporium. So, <laughs> so like behind me, there's, there's only one, one but, but there's, there's a bed, a, bed, uh, a, a recliner, recliner, and a chair. chair. That's, That's it. it. How, How many? Oh, I have How four couches. couches. How, many How many are in storage? storage? I, have I have four couches, couches in storage. I think. Or five. <laughs> Come to Crazy <laughs> Frankie's <laughs> discount <laughs> couch yeah, emporium yeah, this, this weekend. weekend. That's, That's your business. business. So, so couches. Hey. I should just eat. Hey. Come, Come in, come in, my friend. I have a good deal for you. Everything must go. We need to shoot. Going out of business. We need to shoot a Frankie's discount couch emporium ad now. To right. go next to, we need, we need to go anywhere, anywhere. Just, just right to his basement. basement. Next, the, uh, we need that next to Butch dash. Dixon <laughs> as our other sponsor. Uh, uh, but, uh, is, is everything working? working? Just curious because my, my shit's yeah. not. Yeah, we're good. Cool. I can still see you. <clears throat> the only thing that's not working is the <clears throat> refill button on Jeff's bottle. Oh, uh, so, so we. Uh, yeah, yeah no, I gotta, gotta go grab, grab another, another one. one. So we so mentioned, mentioned the cult and guitar. So, so I had an experience. experience. I told, I told Frankie, Frankie this already, but I went, I went to this birthday party, and uh, this guy's like, hey, how you doing? doing? Nice, nice, nice to meet, to meet you. you. And I went, I went to, to shake his hand. hand. He's like, oh, nope. nope. Social, Social distancing. distancing. Gotta, Gotta respect, respect the rules. rules. I'm, I'm like, oh, okay, okay, you know. I respect, I respect that. that. It's, it's your, your own thing or whatever. Then I witnessed this guy pass around a guitar with like five other people. Yeah, yeah, man. And then, and then, and then everyone's, everyone's going, going in the house to go get, get food and stuff. And stuff. He's, He's touching the same door handle, handle everyone's touching. So it's like, okay, I get, I get it. You won't shake my hand, hand but then you're, you're going to touch everything everybody else is touching. You, you got to be all in, in or all out. Right? There's, there's, no, there's no gray. I don't, I don't care, man, if you don't want to shake my hand because this is a Rana. Hey, man, I was you last week. I wanted to give you a hug. Didn't do it. And give you a hug. I think I did shake your hand, though. You had to go home and you you fucking had to throw your clothes in a fire barrel. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> Covered himself in alcohol and lit on fire and then rolled it out. Yep. Relax and you get the hose again. Well, it just sucks that the wind of God hasn't come through Illinois yet. <laughs> Oh, that guy, shit. I'm telling you right now, <laughs> that guy is going to be the first one on screen to actually come out of his true form as a lizard person. Oh, dude, dude he's, he's like, like halfway. halfway. He's, he's like, like dude, he's, transformation. his eyes are there. Like, if you look oh, into his, my God. his eyeballs, yeah, he's straight up lizard that's, person. That's just sad, though. That, that kind of, like, you know what I mean? mean? People, People like, like that, that are just praying, praying on Jesus told me I needed and... a G9. Dude, this shit sucks because, because like, like they're, they're not even churches, churches, so they're like, these some of these people are seriously affected and out of work, work and, and they're, they're like, like, keep donating, donating. Like, like they, they don't, don't have money, money to give, give but, but then they, they trick these right. people. Whatever, Whatever you donate, you're, you're gonna, gonna get back tenfold when we get to heaven. 
So then when some, the, by some dumb, some dumb luck, luck something happens, you know, they, they want to scratch, scratch off. They're like, it's because I don't need it. You said exactly. you won a free ticket. Calm down. Calm down. I'm going to sell. Not, Not like, like you won 5000 a week for life. life. That'd be that happens, sweet. I'm going to be like, damn. That'd be kind of sweet. Huh? All that praying really did work. work. Shit, yeah, I'm man. in. But it's not, not how it works. works. How about that? Yeah, Ten thousand. You turn for something life. into a business, it's completely fucked. What's, What's that, that other one with the, the, the house people that come? Publishers Clearinghouse. Yeah, yeah I'm, I'm gonna, gonna win that shit. shit. You know how many magazines you gotta subscribe to through that shit? <laughs> Garbage I you buy. I don't know what it is. I just know that it's been around forever. Publishers Clearinghouse was like uh, magazine subscriptions at first. That's basically how it started. No, no one's, one's buying those, those anymore. What's a magazine? magazine? Exactly. So now it's like all the like <laughs> as seen on TV knockoff bullshit plus magazines, but like digital. I platform. like a lot of that stuff. Can, Can I, I buy, buy that stuff, stuff and then I win? Or yeah. And, you get, and, your, and basically your name gets put into the raffle. The raffle. How, how many, many raffles, raffles are there? One, one every week? week? No, it's like once every six months or something. Really? really? I thought they'd do more of that than just once or twice a year. I thought they were doing you... I watched the documentary uh, McMillions. Did you guys hear about this? Oh, so kind of talk about the publisher's clearing house and shit. So you know the McDonald's. Monopoly the Monopoly game. game. Yeah, the Monopoly game, and they were, they were stealing so all the time. money from it. It was oh, rigged. It was rigged. This guy was stealing the pieces for, like, the first 11 years, years of the competition. He was yeah. stealing the pieces. It was ran by the mafia. Family members. members. Yes. yes. Fucking crazy, dude. I had no idea about this. Yes. yes. It, it was, was fucking yeah. awesome. I love, I love like, crime shit and, like, and, like documentaries, and this was, like... I was, I was hooked, hooked bro. bro. That, that, it was, it's, it's on, on Netflix? Netflix? Yeah. It's on it's HBO. HBO. Mm, I, got I got your passwords. Don't, don't worry. worry. Yeah. Make yeah. Millions. No, no, dude, it's really... really yeah, yeah, so, so for, for first, first 11, 11, 12 years, years all rigged. rigged. There was, there was no, no legit, legit winners. winners. Yeah. You know yeah. how many McDonald's I ate in those 11, 12 years? I promise you trying to win. Bro, I had a full... Every spot full except for one in each one. So, so that, that was another thing, thing too. Like, like I, I heard now, now um, because, because like I, I actually, actually still really did, really did like playing, playing it, but, but I, I heard, heard as of recent that, that uh, now, now it doesn't, doesn't even say. Like, like it used to be, if you got, got those pieces, pieces you won. Now, now you, you are entered, entered to win. win. So, so like. like you, you can, can get, get the whatever, whatever boardwalk and park place and be like, I want a million dollars. No, you, you want, want a chance to win a million dollars. Oh, that's bogus. Right? right? You, you get put, put in a drawing, drawing or a raffle, raffle like you, you know, know what you I mean? The draw fucking... these nuts. I, don't, I ain't playing right? that game. If you, you haven't seen McMillions, though, and you got HBO, fucking watch that shit. It was awesome. Really? want to touch it? Really interesting. I didn't say that. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to watch it on your account. account. Yeah. Shout out to all the freeloaders so... out there. <laughs> How do you fit in that tank top there? there? Like, yeah, that thing's from, from like... like uh... I remember when it was loose. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh... Ooh. A lovely teapot. <laughs> I got Frankie's, Frankie's been working, working out for like two days. days. He's talking shit. shit. <laughs> feel, feel good. It's, it's been, been like two weeks. weeks. I'm, I'm down a lot. I saw Vane in his bicep. He's like, fuck <laughs> this. <laughs> yeah, with yeah, that vein in his bicep on. was just a clog of cholesterol. That was <laughs> that was just cheese curds Moving making down. its way through. Yo, bro, I've been intermittent fasting, and I made, like, like some, some brats and a grilled cheese, cheese. and then <laughs> I cut up that, that brats and <laughs> grilled cheese. <laughs> I'll only eat one meal a day. I'm allowed to. 
Get up some fatty shit. shit. I okay. get all I my calories like, at one I shot. Ask the Chipotle, Chipotle recipe. recipe. Like, like, how, how you make, make that, that Chipotle, Chipotle chicken. chicken? I want all my calories at one shot. Yeah. <laughs> Daily allotted amount of calories, 2,200. Ranky. I, 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 that's I one like meal. I want calories all day. day. Like, like, how, how do, do I clog them, them in, like, a span like of time? I kind of get like, like an injection of bacon grease just directly into my heart. You, you are, are a super, super fan, fan for, for, for sure. sure. You, you got, got the, the mustache, mustache right, right now. now. You, you just, just need, need to be, be in front of a fucking like like big table, table chicken, chicken legs, and fucking sauerkraut, bratwursts. And you need a button down with a jersey over the top. Whatever. The, the camera, camera screen's all, all fucking. fucking. You're fine. You nice and close, tucked in, right where I need you. Look at you. Can't turn left. left. Jeff, what is this? The center of France. France. Oh, oh, bigger so, than this. should we tell them that we're going to do a shot for shot remake of Fast and Furious? No. Can we really no, no, keep, keep them guessing, guessing, bro. Low oh, budget yeah, on it? We're going to make, make an, an entire movie of Fast and Furious. And Furious. Shot for shot remade. made. I mean, Low budget style. Frankie's, Frankie's got, got time right now. He can. Yeah, I can. I can, I can, I can, I can go, go right, right now. We can. We can do the whole movie. I don't I'm, want to do that right now. The greatest thing about this movie is Ja Rule's character, replayed by a puppet. <laughs> <laughs> Thousand percent. <laughs> See the, the puppet arms like come up, and you know the puppet arms come up and just grab the steering wheel just... and yell, "Menage!" <laughs> <laughs> This is mouth moving like, like fucking bird. Oh, uh, <laughs> the, the yappers. I think, I think we, we might, might know a friend, friend that could uh, direct and shoot this and uh, chop this, this thing up, bro. I actually talked to, talk to a couple, couple people that said they'd be more than happy to uh, fill in in, in, in certain, certain spots, spots in the movie. movie. Maybe that uh, maybe <laughs> that costume designer or that prop designer that we met at C two E two would make there the puppet. Would make the job puppet. <laughs> a puppet. I think oh, I, I can, can make the job, job puppet out of some straws, straws and one of my socks. socks. <laughs> 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 we just need to we just need to set up the green screen and this movie's made in fucking an hour and a half. I just, I just want to do all the voiceovers. Voiceovers? Voice voice what else, man? <laughs> <laughs> Dude, oh, I, I think, think so. Last, last night, uh, uh, we, were we were playing Warzone, Warzone together, and it was just quoting <laughs> <laughs> Fast and Furious, furious. <laughs> like <laughs> fucking three officers <laughs> while, sh- while running, running from, from the, the fucking storm. storm. The, the whole movie was, was pretty, pretty much quoted last, last night, night. Maybe, maybe twice. twice. Yeah. I don't know. I mean, I mean you, you and I did the whole garage scene. scene. That was fucking great. Johnny crying. I was, I was dying. dying. <laughs> and we also laughed for legitimately a half hour of Puppet Jaw Rule. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that was we're all on that level, level two that I could just see Puppet, Puppet Jaw Rule. Like, like, he was right here with me. Oh, he was, he was, was like, like screaming shit at me. Just, me. just his mouth moving. Right? In, in that denim oh, outfit. Oh, in that oh, denim oh, outfit. Oh, One thing that everyone knows is not how you stand for your car. Yeah. It brings us full circle. Hello. Hello. Hey, hey, one, one year, year, right? It's, it's supposed, supposed to be one year. year. 52. Yeah, it is one year. Well, there's 52, 52 weeks, weeks in a year. year. You, you are, are correct. correct. Not so, not 365 and what, one quarter? What's, What's pie? pie? 3.14. Uh, delicious. <laughs> what flavor? Depending on the flavor, delicious. Fucking delicious. That's what it is. Oh shit. Why is it called pie? You know, I have all the ingredients. I bought them probably weeks, weeks, weeks ago for better than sex cake. I just don't want to make it because we're supposed to be on this diet. I'll eat the whole fucking thing. Don't start blurting this out. This is family secret recipe. Um, yeah. Yeah. Ancient yeah. Chinese yeah. secret. My closest, my my closest, dearest friends. Are you, you shut, shut your mouth? mouth. It's now we're gonna have to eat them with. 
I'm pretty sure, sure your, your, your family, family recipe's screwed because every, every chick, every chick I've, I've ever banged has this recipe. Why did you give it to him? See, I don't know. I gotta lure him in with something. You don't give him the recipe. How dare you? I don't, I don't think, think they know. Son of a bitch. Unless he's not that good to just give away the recipe. <laughs> There's a special ingredient the in that better. cake. It's better than sex. She's like, like, babe, I'll, I'll suck, suck your dick, your dick on the way to the bowling alley, alley if you give me that recipe. recipe. <laughs> <laughs> I fuck it. I fuck it. I'm the free to That's right. Mega Lube Bowling. Mega Lube Bowling Lube Center. Strip club, oh, fuck. buffet, God. family eatery. They're so, so good. Stove top, top stuff it in and better than the sex cake. cake. It's, it's so, so good. good. <laughs> but, but like, like it's uh, seriously, it's got, like, it's it's gotta, gotta be, be the like, like thickest, thickest, most, most consistent. consistent. Like, like you, you do, do have, have one, one piece, and you're like, oh, I'm fucking full. Like, like you, you want, want to eat, eat more. It's so good. It's so good. But. You, I know yeah, no boundaries when it comes to that cake. <laughs> I, I don't. don't. I, don't I will sit down with a with fork anything. in the pan and just murder. I always it. preach moderation. Everything, everything in moderation. Everything. I don't. I don't, I don't, I don't do, do anything, anything in moderation. moderation. Be. Even, Even in, in your body, body now. now. Right. But I'm working <laughs> out. <laughs> I'm not drinking coke. Frankie's becoming on a nice diet. diet. The hairline's uh-huh. starting to move back a little bit. The grays are hey, peeking man, through. The, the grays are starting Frankie, to peek through. I'm Frankie's gonna, becoming I a think I hard dyed his shit. I'm going to do it too. What? You're becoming your uh-huh. dad. I think we, we all become our others, right? Isn't that? I haven't left my kids yet. yet. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, oh man! Talking real truth out here. Holy shit. Do better than you, Dad. Oh shit! Oh god! Did god. You, did you, did you, did you, you got everybody laughing. Yeah. That's, that's, that's yeah. the that's the ace of the hole. He's a shot. Just, just hit him all at once. once. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think, I think he, he just slammed his, his hand, hand on it. it. I, I did. He did, he did he the, the fucking, fucking face waterfall on the fucking... <laughs> <head. laughs> Damn! <laughs> <laughs> so uh, I love it. I love it. I love it, right, guys. I, I miss, miss you guys, guys too. You wanna touch it? Do it. No! no. <laughs> Let's touch it. I do I'm miss saying, you guys. I just really miss you, you guys, guys and like, you, you want to touch, touch it? it? And I got, oh. I had a cheddar marinating in my fridge that Jeff and I were supposed to eat today, but now Man. I'm going to eat it alone and cry. <laughs> Bro, I was busy. If, if you, you eat, eat it, it as a woodsman, send me videos. Video my brother in law basically, basically did most of the tree, tree chop. chop. I kind of just pushed, pushed him over. <laughs> You're pushing, pushing trees over? over? I I super hero. Hero. Oh, he's got the fucking Grizzly he's Adams straight. beard now. He's becoming a lumberjack Dude, as well. He's got, he's got the shades on. on. He's, you know, putting a little action in it. And then yeah. I'm like, oh, what way do you, do you want, want this, this to fall? It's like, like, that way. <laughs> Dude, that's what your brother-in-law sounds like. <laughs> <laughs> Yosemite <laughs> Sam. Yeah, his and a chainsaw on his hands. That way. Yosemite he Sam. Pointed, no, he, he pointed, pointed with the chainsaw because he's a man. <laughs> Over there. <laughs> he pointed <laughs> with the chainsaw. Like, like it was an extension, extension of him. So, so yeah, yeah we, he, he cut, cut down, down trees, trees and I pushed him over. over. Look at you and you say you don't, don't work out. out. Well, dude, well, dude that's, that's what, what I'm saying. saying. Like, no, no one, one makes fun, fun of a, a, a power lifter's, lifter's body. body. That's, that's what I have. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're a real Marius Pujanovsky. You're a real, like I said, you're a real Marius Pujanovsky. Dude, all I need to do, this is the trick I have of it. What my body right now, I just, I just need to get, get a shirt. Like, like a, a power lifting shirt. shirt. With the, the belt? belt? 
You're good. <laughs> get a belt. As long as I got this big, big giant, giant belt, belt in the front, front you can't <laughs> really see yeah. how big my, my belly, belly is. Strong, Strong man. man. <laughs> just Dude, walk just... with your lats spread, bro. <laughs> <sighs> Can't, can't fit in the doorway. Can't even walk in the Back of my belt's going to say, big, big girls, girls don't, don't cry. cry. Space, Space Fergie. Fergie. <laughs> <laughs> Hyphen. Just have a Fergie, Fergie quote. <laughs> <laughs> Hyphen Fergie. <laughs> oh, shit. Is there Is anything inspirational? Is there anything to your work? You got a Fergie quote on your lifting belt? Everyone would know the kind of. Tony, you're satin. Thank you, Yelp. This guy got a Fergie quote on his lifted and melted. I feel like that's just like an accessory, though. It's style points. You just wear that out. Like, yeah, lift. Well, you have to have some. There's a bunch of weight around, around and now I got bigger muscles. I got a set of Zubas upstairs. I need a fanny pack. I got those. I got you covered with the fanny packs. Hook it up, bro. We got you, I got you a gentleman's den one. All I'm saying is this can be a thing. We're going to put Dad by Jim. That's a good name for a gym. Dad by Jim. TBG. It'd be a recliner. <laughs> Just trying to get out of there. Right. Nacho. Our next shirt is a TBG. <laughs> from, from, from what is this? TGD. 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 I can't even do it together. Do it. TBG, 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 the gentleman's den, dead by Jim. DGD. DGD. Oh, no, no. DBG. All right, let's move on. Sorry, <laughs> listener. Dead by Jim. Are you saying J or G? What's going on here? Jim. Losing it. saying if I ever owned the bar, I'd call it Jim. One day I'm going to grow up and own a big sports bar. All, All the husbands, husbands out there. there. Where, are Where you going, going honey? Go, go to the gym. gym. Go, go to the gym. gym. <laughs> you ain't going no guy. I mean, I'm gym. telling you, it is genius. I'm but... you, like I said, the ab workout machine is just a recliner that's not motorized. Broken. <laughs> you got to fucking really use the ab. Oh, use the core to get that fucker ah. back up. God, I'm, I'm going to have to write, write this down, down so, so I can actually see it. See it. And then and say, that's cheating. cheating. You cheater. cheater. Can't do it anymore. No, I don't even know. TGD DBG. No, not the BG. We're not trying to stay alive over here. That's all, folks. Have it out of here, baby. You fly. Down. I'm, I'm always hungry. hungry though. I'll, I'll tell you what, what though. I ate those edibles, edibles and they were delicious. delicious. I, snuck, I, I may be snuck a twizzler with, with the edibles. edibles. That, does, that, that doesn't, doesn't matter, matter, right? What? Wait, were you like bacon wrapping the edibles with the twizzlers? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Just think of it a little bit extra. You know, Sweet dude. Is it one of those like bowls of candy and just leave it out? And just mix the edibles in there. Did I just eat another man's candy? You fucked up. Are they just, just laying around to take one? one? Those, Those aren't supposed to be out. Do <laughs> you imagine if you ate the whole rope? That's 400 million. Holy crap, friend. friend. <laughs> oh. oh, man, I missed that movie. I haven't seen that one in a minute. In a minute. That was, that was the second, second one, right? Ted 2? Yeah. <laughs> Morgan Freeman. Oh, my God. When he gets hit by the... Fucking Starship Enterprise. Oh, Christ. Just hip shot. I think, I think we're, we're all alone now. now. Well, 
We're coming to the end of this podcast. We'll, I'm just going to say it's it's time to follow a little Jackie Moon advice and a little ELE. Everyone love everybody. Everybody, everybody love everybody. everybody. It's it's getting a little scary out there, folks. Uh, I ain't going to lie to you. Yeah, yeah no, I'm, I'm, I'm all, all for, for the people, people protesting. protesting. <clears throat> I'm all for that, 200%. But the, the looting and the rioting and the, the damage to people's properties and businesses that they've built and Well you're burning down right you're message. burning down your own home. Right. Yeah, it's not the right message. It's sad. Um and I you, you know, you, you know that the, the victims that these people are, are protesting for are this is not what they want. They don't they don't want the, the, the violence no. and the the, the destruction and the, I mean, look at where everything is going. And I mean, we're, we're from a pandemic and losing over a hundred thousand people. That's twice as much as all the Vietnam war we just lost in the last six months. And then for, for all this destruction, these businesses that have already been hurting from the pandemic and now are getting destroyed and looted and stuff. It's just, it's sad. It really is. And it's, unfortunate and like you said man ELE come together you know it's it started out with the threats of World War 3 breaking down it really it really is scary then we had COVID well, well we had, there a bunch of hurricanes too her, and Kobe died oh, the flooding and Kobe stuff died going on right now? Oh. All right, we had the Australian fire that the went Australian on forever. Fire. Then, yeah, half of Australia was burning. That's how we started it. Sneeze. <laughs> then World Corona's War Three. Then uh, Kobe. And when Kobe ha- right after Kobe happened, it was Rona time. Yeah, no, it hasn't been the greatest. It's uh, yeah. and it, it's yeah, unfortunate. Like, like Sean said earlier, this is probably the craziest year I could ever remember. Oh yeah, I mean September 11th, obviously, but that was like a an event, you know. This yeah. is just going on. For oh yeah, months. we had UFOs and no one gave a shit. Yeah, that was in the news no, for two yeah, seconds. Mm-hmm. I, mean, I mean, I think it's pretty. If there's if there's other life forms, I think that's pretty extravagant. But it's well, have you ever seen a magician live? I mean, this is what they do here. Look over this here. is all sleight of hand yeah. right now. It's all right. sleight of hand right now. Like, all right, let's get but, all this bullshit out. And and there are things. There's tons of stuff that's happening. That's getting it's getting slid over and and missed and and not talked about and. You know, like right now, do you think that there needs to be innocent people that are in hospitals when COVID's going on? And they're they're already, you know what I mean? Like, they just had to deal with all this shit. Now they're dealing with all these people with injuries and shit like that. Like, it's just, it's it's sad. And I know that this is a better country than what it's showing right now. 100%. Well, we live in a... a, there's no greater time to be alive than right now, and I think people have gotten soft. And it is scary too that everyone's been like locked up and like they just want to run free now. Right? Like it's something's going on. They're like, it's this is the first time that they've I want to be there in months. Yeah, in months. In all that built up, like, I mean, shit. I'm fucking working out again. That's how much I'm fucking feeling trapped inside. I'm lifting weights. And 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 then stop drinking pop and like making changes, because like you you do go stir crazy. Like I want to go out and see you guys and like all this like built up angst that everyone has and stuff and energy that they haven't been able to to you know control and focus on something is right. all being released right now. And well, it's, even physical contact, just being around people, shaking right, someone's right. hand, someone's giving hand. someone a hug. Right. How many times do you stand it next to me and you'll grab me Argh! just for no reason? It's just that contact, you know? Yeah, I, I don't miss your thigh grabs. So don't bring <laughs> those back. Uh, leave those. You leave do those, miss and see. Leave those those right in the world. Leave right, those, these, look at these hands. Leave those in, leave, leave those in COVID time. 
I, I'm just oh, saying, right. and it is sad though. That is sad. I mean, I've even said it back in the day when like you'd see other countries and they have to wear masks when they're outside to avoid infection and and for their lives. And you're like, man, that's or or, or you know just where they live and, and and the quality of the air isn't and stuff. It's 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 horrible. It's unfortunate. And like now that we go outside and we're not allowed to like be outside without masks and it's 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 very 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 scary from the world that we all grew up in it's pretty fucking wild it's wild time it's just like it, it's scary for like i mean i know this stuff and i know from what we grew up watching and in, in like the history books and like seeing things and like i know things have to happen and voices need to be heard and and like actions for what that cop did to him is is never acceptable and I get where everyone's coming from, but like where it's escalated past, you know what I mean? Like I'm all about getting the, the, the word out and, and, Bro, and this having change over the last this. five years. This has been our last four years. Let's be honest. This has been getting to bubble under the surface. The police first. BLM. Yeah. Yeah. Cause then you had the, Blue Lives Matter, and then everyone's fighting, and yeah. then yeah, you're a protest, all these people protest. are like, all lives matter, and then it's like, well, yeah. Well, now what's crazy uh, is... You they're can not s- saying no, but Black Lives Matter isn't no, this saying is, the other races. They're just saying that Black Lives matter, matter, too. Right. Like, everyone matters, but we matter, too, motherfuckers. Yeah. It's it, it is sad that like that we're still going through this. Like you said, with what we grew up watching as kids, and seeing and hearing and and, and you know the, the stories, and then seeing this like this like like I said, we're we're definitely better as a country than this. And like, um, I, I I do agree though. Like we all do need to change. That's why like this is a you know voting year. Like it's scary to say, but like. This is where everyone needs to have a voice and stand up and make changes for the better. Which means, boys, you need to leave your house this year and actually vote. Yes. Yeah, it really does. Because we can't be... And it does suck because, like, no matter what, it's going to be better than these than what it is right now. But like, we really need to come together and, as like a, a country, like, why, like, I, like we, we need, are, like, you know, we need more progressive thinking folks in office. I'm sorry to say it. I mean, yeah, no, these ninety when you have a ninety year old senator, dude, someone's got to be better. <laughs> someone's yeah, got to be better. You're set in your ways when, when at a different time too. When you got a, you know, the governor, the governor of Mississippi saying some real ignorant shit. How is he getting Bottom, elected? Yeah. How is he getting I elected? Already said. I, I won't repeat it because it's, uh, the line was, if you, if you can talk, you can breathe is what he said. Oh, Jesus Christ. Yeah. That's, that's yeah. what I'm saying. Like it's, it's, it's unfortunate. And, and trust me, like there's. There's always those lines and this and that, and, like, everyone wants to feel safe. You know what I mean? Everyone wants to be able to walk and be free and not have a worry and stuff. But that's the thing is, too, like, I'm scared to go certain places in the world. It, it's just that's that's how it is in in the place that we are and in society and in the country, and that could change. Like, it needs to change. But it is something that isn't going to happen like overnight. It, it's it, it starts this is just <clears throat> like you said, the voting beginning. this year. This is just the beginning. Think about it. we're not yeah. even well, si- we're slow. not even at the six month mark of this year, and we've already ridden the fucking not so much ridden the fucking tidal wave of fucking emotions. Yeah, man. Dragon. No, it's it's scary. It's definitely scary, and Dragon's I mean, everyone tale. that's dealing with this, I, you know, you hear about, like, certain families, though, that are already there. Just think of these families that are leaving right now. They're being evacuated out of their homes because it's not safe from the fires that are being set and stuff. They're burning down these neighborhoods and these homes. Where are these people to go during a pandemic where everything's closed? And Exactly. It's, it's so sad. It's, it's seriously it's, and, so sad. And it's also putting more power in the hands of the government because the government's right, going like, to take care of these families 
this isn't the way to do it. It's, I don't want to. I don't want to start getting political, but right. I don't. Yeah. I already yeah. told. I but already I told like you some guys. Some of them feel like I know. We kind of look at it, and you we're like, "Wow, this is extreme. This is excessive." Yeah. You know, maybe that's your opinion on it. But it's sad to think that that they, they feel like they need to do this to be heard. Be heard. Yeah. Right. Yeah. And, and and like this I is, don't I think don't that is the, the the whole truth. And when they oh, say of stuff course like, it's not. I mean, not everyone's doing it, but I, you know, some people are using this as an excuse to fucking grab shit off the shelves or, you know, the bash in windows. And I mean, this is basically just kind of like a purge right now. Right. It's it's sad. Like it's like basically I mean. a free for all. Every all these psychopaths are getting out some of their aggressions. Like I don't know. And you know it's going to get worse before it gets better like everything else like every night it's escalated more and more and more and that's what's sad like these business owners that and losing everything and and it just it's it's sad. that's why like when they say like get your voice heard like be out there during the times that like you need to be out there and then when they have these curfew set there's curfew set i think it was like 20 different cities in like 11 states um that's almost it, making you're, it a police after that, you're not a protester it's almost making it a police state, though. No, I, understandable, but if, if if this is going to continue, though, where people's cars are getting vandalized oh, and smashed. I mean, people are driving I, down the road just trying to get home, and people are smashing their windows and shit. Yeah, see, that's fucked up. You well, know? That's right. Like, but they didn't have nothing to do. The news is already this. trying to spin it again. I, the video I showed you earlier frank here we listened to earlier the guy's getting interviewed and he says all i did was lean out my window and say all lives matter and two black men jumped me cut to video of said man outside his ga- car with a full bow and arrow drawn getting oh, ready to that sh- fucking crazy See, bastard yeah. that's what i'm saying that's and then, a dumb fuck too like I, I do remember you here and you that's First what I mean, of all, though. he's fucking dumb. You never approach a mob with one arrow. What? Yeah. <laughs> um, this is what I'm saying. I think that's you're looking at this at the wrong angle, arrow. Jeff. Like, that's his first mistake. I'm just saying. If I was to show up to with one out bullet, of forty thousand people I'd have more than an arrow. Need more than one shot. It, no, but that's what I'm saying. Wait, that's stupid. No, that's, but that's not even. He, he, he had one I, of those magic arrows. I wouldn't even address this fucking guy. As soon as right. I saw a guy get out of a car with a, a bow and arrow, I would just. Wouldn't the crowd just point and laugh? Yeah, that's oh, what I'm saying. They no, just the beat the shit out of him. I'm talking about. And he the, deserved the, it. The 50 year old woman, the little woman in her car that's driving on the expressway that was in LA, and. These people jump out in front of her car as she's following people through the shoulder, and she tries to like dr- drive continuously at like two miles an hour through, and they start hitting her car and, and swinging shit. Next oh, thing I you know, they're breaking yeah. out her window. Dude, that's not necessary. That little lady now she has to go and you know what I mean. No one knows everyone's life, but like you're just vandalizing someone that's trying to get home. That's not protesting to get your word out. That is straight destruction and vandalism, and it's it's. It's breaking laws, and I get it. Like, all laws are in place. Like, I don't believe in all laws. Some of them are, are fickle, and, and you know what I mean? But they're there for a reason. So we don't have what's going on every single night in places burning down. So it's just, like, think about this. And, like, just, like, like, like I even hear in so many different people say things, like you said, news reporters, and, like, we're, like, these, like, famous actors and leaders and people that, like, why are they and not? No one's going to on touch this right pages. now. No one's going to touch this right now. Because if you say, know, some if you people have came out and said no, some things. It's the look. They can't look bad yeah. in the public eye. If public opinion, I'm going to tell you right now. Right. It's their this brand, is where, and this is stupid. This is why I'm scared. And this is probably going to be where we end the podcast, too, because uh, the news put out a report about Mr. Floyd, who was killed, George Floyd that died, that he's had health problems and all this other bullshit. And the prosecutor uh, attorney, the attorney for the cop is going to get this thing tried to get it pushed down to a misdemeanor. 
Well, that's what I'm saying. And this won't happen Try to get for it pushed months or whatever. Try to get it pushed out to involuntary and, man, and manslaughter. I, I get it. And, and whatever his substance he was on, they obviously said he was on something. It was either it was drugs or alcohol, which was going to contribute to – I, I get it. Yeah, it's sad. Like you said, that they're going to go in, in, in the court of law, and you're not going to look at it as if it was just murder like it was. Like the fact that he remained it on his throat, you know, while he was motionless for two minutes – Minute and fifty three seconds or whatever. It's 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 sick. Also, it, the, it, it, the, it does need the justice. two other cops on top of them. I mean, it's it was a, it's a shitty situation. Right, right. I don't want to yeah, go more in depth horrible. into it because everybody's already scared and pissed off. I just want everybody to be safe so we can keep this wagon rolling. Right. E L E. Everyone love everyone, yeah, man. Pull together. We'll get we're we're this. better than this. Yeah. We yeah. We're better than this as, than a, as a country. It's just another bump in the road. It's gonna get yeah. worse before it gets better. But stay safe. Stay safe. Stay positive. COVID. And we love you. Yeah. <laughs> That's all I love can say. Guys. Really. Love you guys. Love you boys. Love our listeners. Love you guys. Go to shop.spreadshirt.com backslash the hyphen gentleman's hyphen den and buy a shirt. Support your Get a mask. And if anybody wants to sponsor us, you know, we'll show our titties. <laughs>